<sighs> oh. What a nice flight this is. With my little boy Timmy here next to me. Oh, he's drawing something. For Timmy. What's a survival book? Oh, convenient. I'm gonna take this. Some turbulences. Wow. That's that's not bad. I mean, how, how bad? Oh, what the fuck? Looks like it's gonna be some some bad turbulences. Hold on to me, Timmy. It's all gonna be alright. Okay. That didn't look good. <gasps> Who is that? The man in red. Taking my boy. Oh, you stupid pedo. Well, we gonna get him back. At least we have the drawings still, huh? Well, welcome back to a new Let's Play. I just have to check my mouse sensitivity. This looks alright. Yeah, let's play Green Hell. Um, I have played this game before. Just gonna have a little snack here. I have played this game before, actually twice. And uh, we've played it on, uh, on stream with Stefan. And um, the streams are on his uh, Twitch account. Oh, yeah, I just picked this up. Oh, my dear, she doesn't look good. What the fuck happened to her arm? This, is this, that, does that work? How is that? No. Anyways, yeah, you can watch the streams on his channel. I'm going to put it in the video description. And I thought, I'm just going to, you know, get all these snacks here. I thought this might be a good addition to my collection of survival game let's plays that i have on my channel pick up all the soda cans and the mats and everything the tray i think i don't need to eat more pick up all the things i don't know if you have uh, played this game before or if you've seen um videos of it or whatever but yeah it's another it's another survival game um I don't even know when this came out, but yeah, I'm just gonna record a little playthrough here. I don't really have plans, like I don't have planned anything for this. We're just gonna see where this takes us. Um, I'm gonna get all the good stuff. Here's some cloth and some... what actually is that? Uh, nope, that wasn't it. How can I open my inventory? Here. Some snacks! Yeah, got some soda, got some snacks. I really like the inventory here. Um, some booze that we can use to craft different things. Oh yeah, I can pick up sticks. And I think in this game, I can... I mean, I can't pick up like infinite uh, amount of stuff. But... Um, I can't, you know, carry too much so I can't move anymore like in Green Hell. Which is good, so I can just, you know, pick up... No! Ah! Oh, come here! Um, I can I can pick up as much as I want. Until it tells me I can't carry any more of this. Oh, I can kill the fish as well with my axe, I think. Holy shit. Nice. And yeah, we crashed with a plane. And some weird man covered in blood took our little boy, who's called Timmy. And we have to survive and get him back. Um, I think we have this. Yeah, we have this book with crafting recipes as well. Or well, we have all the recipes already. It's a bit different than in Green Hell, which I played last time. And I kind of know my way around. The island, uh, but I have no idea where we crashed right now. 
just gonna walk in one direction now just to get an overview of where I am. Is is this sink? No, oh no, I thought it's the sinkhole. Um this is a lake. I'm a bit lost. I mean there's a map that I can find. But I don't have it yet. Do I know? No, I need to pick it up somewhere. And all over this map there are these little villages. Um ah, damn it. inhabited by usually well some kind of natives, but as you can see they have a special diet. They prefer the good meat, the good human meat. So it is a, it is clear that I don't wanna run into their arms. Um, yeah, I'm gonna just get as much stuff as I can get. And he's he's been he's been chilling here for a while. Um, well, and then it is time to build a base and you know get all the things I need to defend myself before starting into the the real story ah, I don't want this ball oh there's a pot here damn it I always click this uh, wrong button that's what you get when you play different games this old pot is actually quite useful to boil water I didn't expect it to find it here already um, anything else? Did I miss anything? Quite some heavy rain. <laughs> how many, how many uh, birds did I kill with one stroke? Now, did I not pick up birds? Oh no, there. Yeah, I got two pieces of meat. I can cook later. Um, 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 do you see the sun? Not really, huh? Just gonna keep walking in one direction. There's, there's water all around. Pick up some flowers so I can mix my own medicine with it. Um, oh yeah, I need stones as well. I'm really getting confused with like the two games now. I kind of expected him to pick up a big stone and carry it around in his hands. Like in green hell. Where the fuck am I? Okay, there's a cave. I think there's a cave. I see lots of these totems. Effigies. And there's a cave entrance here somewhere. No. Oh, eh? Why are there so many of these effigies here? Huh? I could swear there would be a cave entrance nearby. This may be the entrance? No. Hmm. Weird. Okay. Anyways, the caves are not important for us right now. First we need to, you know, um, get some build like a shelter oh fuck they're there already oh you hear him scream he's jumping around there just one of them but i still don't want to fight him right now he's following me now uh, where are we this is the ocean yeah i'm gonna walk that way as I said, I kind of know my way around the island and I know a place that is quite safe in the beginning, I think. I'm gonna go there first. He's still following us. No. Yeah, we're gonna go there first and 
build our first shelter, get a campfire going. Some nice mushrooms on the way. And craft some... There's a deer, but I don't have a bow, you know, I need to craft like a spear and a bow and all the usual things you need to survive. Good thing that the only thing I took from the plane was my book. A survival skill book. I'd be lost without that. Um, I turned up the brightness and everything. I'm not sure if it's like too bright now. I think the game in general is quite bright at day time and at night time or in caves it's like really dark um, and actually I've read that if you change the brightness in caves it doesn't really change much because there are not so many light sources in caves and if there is no light then uh, nothing changes Ooh, some dynamite Ropes. Can't carry more ropes. See, if I pick this up now, it just drops because I can, oh, can only carry four ropes. Oh, I have five. Um, I am confused as. I didn't know this hut. I know up there there should be the big village. Can show you guys the big village village even though it might not be a good idea I don't know if they changed anything in the game since I last played it well, we definitely come back here later hmm. yeah I'm a bit confused this one hut I kind of I didn't know that one but here we are. This is the right way to the... It's a good... It's like the, the easiest uh, area to start, really. Well, the area where we are going to. Is there something here? A picture drawn by a little boy. It's uh, Timmy and me with an axe, or is it a gun? I don't know. And there's red paint. If you paint yourself red... Then the um, the natives of this island, the cannibals, um, are not so aggressive. They don't attack right away. I didn't get that one. But like if I go into water now, it washes off. And it wasn't really necessary for me to paint myself now. Oh, I hear them. Oh, they're right in front of me. A group of two, three. No. Did he sneak around that? Well, he definitely saw me. Yeah, he saw me. I'm gonna, gonna run away. a way to cross this river without washing my paint off they're not right away oh look he's climbing on the on the tree and then they jump at you as well ah! <laughs> they usually don't attack right away only if you make them aggressive and there's different behavior that makes them aggressive i'm gonna try to jump around uh, above the river without washing my paint off yeah i managed to do it they don't go into water i think they can cross over there but they don't go into water. So if you build a boat, you're pretty much safe. Um, yeah, this area is usually quite safe. Sometimes there are some of them wandering around here, but um, usually it's, uh, it's a good area to start. Um, so I'm gonna build, I'm gonna build my first shelter, I think. Which one am I going to build? Temporary hunting shelter. Small cabin. I'm gonna go for the hunting shelter first, because it's... Uh, 
Uh, it doesn't need so much time to build it. Because this game, like if you want to build a big base, it can get quite um, grindy. All the things in here. And then it's time to chop down some trees. Oh, look, there are two right next to each other. And then, yeah, I'm gonna build uh, trees. I can't remember, does the... When I build a fire and it starts to rain, does the fire go out? I can't remember. Come on! What? Die, tree! There we go! First one. I'm gonna take this one right away as well. Nicely chop around it. And it's falling in the same direction. No, it doesn't. How many can I carry? Oh, just, just two. Okay. That's okay. That's okay. And there are lots of rabbits here. And there's a squirrel. In other words, there's lots of food. And then... Yeah, we're gonna build... I mean, this is just a small sh shelter, right? We want to have a bigger one. I'm gonna... Uh, make some tools first. Also, I can see that I need to drink. Um, I think there were uh, water collectors that catch the rainwater. And then later it's time to go down into the caves. Because there we find uh, find some more... Huh. No, I didn't need that one. Um, in the caves we... F Is this on now, the hold? No. Uh, in the caves we find actually items and tools and equipment that we can't craft. Well, this, is, this is done. Can save the game now. Oh, look. I'm just gonna use this slot. That was a an old game. I think it was more like um, a test game or whatever. The two two deers. So what was that? Oh. Okay. How can I? I think I want a spear and a bow. How does that work? No, I need. Um, crafted bow. Oh, and this. There we go. Um, and now I need arrows. Ooh. Suppose I need more more feathers. Well, where can I get feathers? <laughs> Just like that. Oh, I can't carry more birds. <laughs> okay. Uh, time to build a fire as well, but uh, let's let's build some. Okay. And now I want to put this on the quick lock, quick slot. Um. The two. Yes. Okay. Cool. Um fire how can i build a fire I'll right here just a small one i need another small stick sometimes you find them lying around under trees so you can pick up all these stones as well and yeah, do we have a have a stick lying around i mean i can just cut down these as well Maybe I shouldn't sprint so much. Probably drains my energy. There we go. And in this game, we don't need a fire starter because we have our 
uh, indestructible big lighter <laughs> that uh, never runs out of fuel. Okay, let's put. Oh, damn it, I don't want to do that. Let's put on some meat. Put two meat on there because there was one lying here. And here as well. How convenient that the birds always land on my shelter. So I never run out of um, meat and feathers. Can I eat it already? Oh yeah, no, I can eat it. Uh-huh, and the other one as well. And I have the pot. Can I fill the pot with water here and put it on the f on the fire? Is this weather? Yeah. It's the right direction. I'm getting thirsty. Um let's see. How does this work again? Equip. No, I didn't want to wash it off. Can I not get water from here? Eh? I thought I can get water from here. Does that only work at these little ponds? That's annoying and not very realistic. But I know that we have a pond nearby. It's good that I don't need to figure out all the mechanics. Oh yeah, no, I'm get I'm I'm wet because I. Uh, damn it, that's not a good idea. I need to go back to the fire. Uh, I'm I'm wet because I just went into the water. And now because it's night time, I start to freeze. The cold and wet build a fire to get dry, yeah. I think once I'm dry, I'm okay. At night time, I'm just... I should not get wet. What, is there water in the pot now? No, the pot is empty, right? How can I get my pot back, though? Damn it! No, I don't want to put things in there. I want to get my pot back. That's annoying. That is annoying. <laughs> you don't seem to care so much. Sorry, that was that was really cruel. <laughs> I apologize for that. Um, mm. what am I supposed to do now? What if I destroy the fire? Do I get my pot? I get my pot back. Okay, fair enough. Uh, did you hear that scream? It's the bad guys. But yeah, I'm not not so scared. There was a light just there, wasn't there? I think I saw a light. Might have just been a glitch or something. Ah, uh, there we go. See? I'm getting water. Yeah, the survival aspect of this game is not that challenging, really. Um, I don't even know what mode I'm playing on. Do you see that somewhere? I think I even play on the normal uh, difficulty mode. But um, <clears throat> last time in the stream we played on like hard survival or so on. There wasn't, there wasn't a big difference, really. So, um, yeah game is not focused so much on the survival aspect in terms of um, staying hydrated and having enough food and all that. I mean, it is there, but I think the main challenge are the, the fights in the caves. And the longer you play this game, um, the stronger the enemies get and different animal uh, animals enemies start to spawn we do, we don't only have the the cannibals we have some some bigger things coming up later but i'm not gonna spoil that in, in case not everyone knows the game 
I really, I really want to drink some water now. There we go. Thank you. That was helpful. Okay. Um, and another thing I want is... Oh yeah, we also have a to-do list. It is really like in the green hell. Like these games are so similar in many aspects. So our main goal is find Timmy, our son. And you know, we set up a camp already. Well, yeah, kind of. Find and... Um, what did it say? Cook! Oh, find and cook food. And find the missing plane passengers. Yeah, because in the plane we found... No. We found this notes. Huh? Where is that though? Oh, here. This one. And there are names of all the plane passengers. And you find these people uh, around this island. Well, you find their corpses and it's kind of like a... Yeah, side quest where I don't even know if you get a reward if you find all of them actually. I think I never did. Just like like collectibles, you know. Nothing really important. And you find these little drawings. Still don't know if this is an egg. It's probably an eggs. Because if it would be a gun, you would like hold it uh the wrong way around and it looks like he would give it to Timmy. <laughs> I don't know. Um, yeah, another thing I want to build is... What happened to the... Oh, these are just red birds. They kind of looked dead. I'm hungry again. I just ate. Let's throw some more bird meat on there. Um, another thing I want to build is a drying rack. Which I can use to dry meat. And then it is um, doesn't rot so quickly. And for that, I need more sticks. Because if I put it on the fire, if it's on the fire for too long, it will just burn. And if it's raw in my pocket, it's gonna um, gonna it's gonna decay. If I dry it. The best way to um, to keep it for a longer period of time, especially if I want to go into caves and need to stock up on food first. Yeah, there's really so many deers around here. It's like the only place on the map I think where you find so much food. So that's a good starting point, and then I kind of we can see where we wanna where we're gonna take this. I can put my food on here. Is this rotten already? No. Still good, right? Ah, damn it. Raw fish edible. Yeah. I put it here. Well. This was a good first day, I think. Oh, the, the food is done. Before it burns. No, was it burned already? I think it's, I think it's burned. Because it doesn't really... That nah, doesn't matter. I think it was a good first day. And next time... Next episode... Well, we'll see what we're gonna do next time. See you in the next episode. Bye-bye.